In this lecture, I will show you how to use the switch node. And as you'll see, it's very simple. You can find the switch node under function. So the way that the switch node works is very simple. It's like an if statement in a regular programming language. So in the switch node properties window, you can set any number of properties. And for each property, you set a condition. And then depending on which condition is true, uh, appropriate output will be sent out. So in this case, I've got two conditions. Uh, the first one is for any number that comes in through the payload or message payload that is larger than five. And the second condition is true if uh, the number that comes through the message payload is less than or equal to five. And of course, you have all sorts of other conditions or rules that you can, uh, you can use in your properties. You can also set the switch node to continue checking all rules. So if you set it to all rules, then output will be triggered for any rule that is true, or you can get it to stop after the first match is found. So then um, I'll be just typing in a different number in my message payload to see how the switch node behaves. So let's deploy that and have a look at the debug window and I'm looking at the current flow only and it, right now the, uh, the the trigger will send out a payload with a number six to the switch node so let's trigger that and you can see that this node uh, was activated this debug node debug node with name larger than five or greater than five and the number that came through is six Okay, this debug node just, just prints out the payload and this is its name. I'm going to change uh, the payload to 3. Uh, redeploy to make the change effective. Uh, trigger it. And you can see now that we've got a 3 coming through because this debug node was activated, which is less than or equal to 5. So you can use this switch node to implement conditional logic in your in your flows as you would using an if statement or a switch structure in a regular programming language.